again I'm going to show you how I cut out a back uh, with my laser en engraver and this is the Corel Draw version X4 that's 14 um, I drew the uh, the outline of the guitar using uh, vectors and I've increased the size of it by about 0.2 of an inch so that it gives me some um, wiggle room around the edge when I glue it on that I'll trim off later before I put the bindings on. So there's the uh, guitar shape. Uh, this is a OLF MJ, a medium jumbo shape. I'm going to print it to the laser and before I can print it I've got to make sure the properties are good. That all looks good. And then I've actually got to go and turn the laser on, so excuse me a second. You can probably hear the lasers turned on now, down the other end of the room. And uh, so I'm going to go ahead and send this file. Print. And then we move over to the laser. Okay, here's the uh, nice piece of rosewood that I've been changing uh, to the right size. I'm going to put that in the laser. And around about the 10 inch mark. I'll we'll put this light on a minute. Because I want to check that the center uh, is the center seam where I glued it is exactly the same distance from the side of the laser. There. That's perfect. And uh, there's no real reason to make sure it doesn't move, but I always like to add a bit of extra weight with these big steel strips. Just put those in the middle. These out here. That's enough. And now I have to line the laser up with the center line of the, the glue line. To do that, first of all, I'm going to turn on the pointer, the red pointer, you can see it there. I'm going to have to move the bed up quite a bit, and then focus the laser using this little tool. So the laser is exactly in focus now using this tool. This, this tool here just sets the height. And now I can move the laser position so it's exactly on that center line and um, the guitar itself is about 20 inches. Okay, so the laser's aligned, the work's aligned, the laser's focused. So if you close it up, turn off the pointer, set this as the home position. And then go ahead and cut it.
Okay, the job's done. I'll just take it out. There we are. One nice, fully cut out guitar shape. Beautiful.